So let's go back and show you also, uh, we got Danica Patrick's side of what happened. She ended up 33rd today, uh, the first time this year that she has DNF after this contact with the 99 of Ryan Truex. We heard Ryan say on the radio that uh, he, he was accepting the blame on this, but we really hadn't had a chance to talk to him. We did get uh, Danica's opinion on it. Give you this angle, and here you go, guys. Let me take a look at it. I mean, we're getting the back end of it right there, but it looks like Ryan came down just a little bit as Danica was coming up. In my opinion, they just mo both meant together in the middle of the track. I can't put any blame on either one of these competitors. It's just the way you race at Bristol. Nobody did anything wrong. Dave? Oh, Rusty, as many times as you've won, I know you've had incidents at Bristol, too, so stuff just happens here. Ryan, your side of the incident that ended Danica's day and kind of ruined yours, too. It was my fault. Um... I guess that's just racing at Bristol. Um, you know, we were we were fighting a loose car all day. I was, I mean, I was wrecking sideways through the center of the corner and off. And, um, and we were racing there, and I just came off the corner, got loose. And you know, as I was saving it, just came down the hill and got into her. My fault. I mean, I'm sorry. You know, I didn't want for that to happen. I don't know. I don't know if she thinks I did it on purpose or. I guess she's just mad because she was running good or whatever, but it was an accident, and you know I apologize, and I'll try to talk to her, see see what she thinks, and, and uh, you know just hate it for them. I know they were having a strong run. I hate it for my guys. You know we were having a great run today, and and uh, you know things just didn't go our way. Ended up a few laps down, but uh, my fault. Sorry, didn't mean for it to happen, and uh, you know I definitely don't try to race people like that, so I apologize. All right, see you next week at Fontana. Thanks. All right, Ryan Truex, I think I don't think it'll dampen either driver's uh, uh, desire to do well next week, guys. No, not at all. And uh, Ryan, of course, as we mentioned, turned 19 just yesterday. Uh, any final thoughts, guys, before we throw it over to Alan? Well, I think the guys learned a lot with the tire change. I really got to commend Goodyear and NASCAR. They made a fantastic move. They had no problems today with tires, and it was a good call what they'd done. Yeah, I agree with you, Rusty, on that. And Goodyear did do a great job. But, man, somebody's got to stop this Kyle Busch guy. He is winning everything. Well, I'll tell you what. He led every lap at Phoenix. One here today, leading a total of 268 laps. Crosses over 10,000 total in his career. Unbelievable. So let's send it over to you, Alan, and uh, take us on home.